Your latest news update from Western Mass News. I'm Chris Pisano with a look at your headlines. On Wednesday, Holyoke Police, along with state and federal law enforcement, carried out a search warrant that led to the arrest of 41-year-old Anel Serrano of Holyoke. Followed a lengthy investigation into a narcotics trafficking operation based in the Highlands neighborhood of Holyoke, the search resulted in the seizure of large amounts of cocaine and heroin, as well as cash and two illegal firearms. At this time, one of the illegal firearms recovered is considered a ghost gun, an AR-15. Serrano was arrested for drug trafficking along with firearms charges. The investigation is ongoing. Two teacher strikes in Massachusetts have forced thousands of students out of school. Classrooms in Malden and Haverhill school districts were empty Monday as teachers took to the picket lines. The unions for the educators are in contract negotiations with the respective districts. Teachers say they want higher pay, smaller classes, and safer school environments. Teacher strikes are banned under Massachusetts law, which makes them incredibly rare. And the Celtics have unveiled their new uniforms for opening night. The City Edition uniforms honor the late and great Bill Russell. The team will be wearing the special uniforms at Tuesday's opener at the TD Garden against the 76ers. Eleven diamonds line each side of the uniform, signifying the number of championships Russell won. And his now retired number six featured as well. Russell died back in July at the age of 88. I'm meteorologist Jana Brown with a check of your forecast. We'll start the day off tomorrow with some lingering showers and quite a few clouds in place. Showers are going to be exiting throughout the early morning, so most of our Tuesday is looking dry. Skies will turn partly cloudy as we head toward noon, and especially in the afternoon we'll start seeing more sun. And temperatures will climb into the low 50s for the hills and some middle to upper 50s for the valley. Breezes will be on the lighter side out of the south and west. Now, temperatures are going to stay on the cool side through much of this week. Highs Wednesday and Thursday will both be in the mid 50s. We'll be dealing with gusty breezes out of the southwest both days, but at night, calm, clear, and cold. Temperatures Wednesday morning could fall into the upper 20s, and we're close to freezing both Thursday and Friday mornings. The weekend turns warmer. 68 Saturday with plenty of sun, and then Sunday more clouds start building in. And it looks like there's a chance for a couple of showers into early next week. Not a good chance right now, but that's definitely our next chance. And that will be followed by a transition back to cooler weather. Stay with Western Mass News on air, online, and on our app throughout the day for breaking news, weather, and exclusive content.